Hello, everybody. This is Steve Grizzetti, co-founder of MoviePix.com and author of the MoviePix.com Guide to Adobe Premiere Elements. And here we are looking at some of the new features in version 2024 of Premiere Elements. And one new feature in version 2024 is actually a reworking and a great improvement of a very old feature. The highlight reel tool in the program will create sort of an instant movie from your raw video clips. You just provide the media and the program's going to use AI to automatically select the best segments from each clip and it's going to create a mini movie for you. The tool also is going to provide music for the highlight reel and it even allows you the option of adding a look or a color gradation to your movie. Let me show you how it works. To create a highlight reel, you just go up to the create button in the upper left hand corner of the program and select highlight reel. We can select our media from one of the albums in the organizer here on the left hand side or we can simply go to the upper right hand corner and browse on our computer to select some media. And I'm just going to select some video clips here. Click open. Once I've added my media clips to my pool, I can select the layout for them. Now for me, I usually choose 16 by 9, but it's up to you if you're creating media for a particular social media site. You have options here based on each site for creating a particular aspect ratio. But let's stick with 16 by 9 for me. And we can add music to the track also down here at the bottom. Now you have access to the whole library of scores. These are custom music clips that match the length of your movie. Or you can browse to your computer by clicking on your tracks and use any song from your personal collection. But let's select a flower for you. And let's scroll up to the top of the screen. And I'm going to select the option here to mute media audio. So I don't want to hear people talking or room noise or any of those things going on in the clips. I only want to hear that song and then have the visuals of the highlight reel created for me. So I select the option to mute the media audio and then click on the create button. The program is going to look through each video clip it's going to detect the best scenes, the ones with most interesting lighting, the best focus, the most faces, media clips with people in them, and it's going to cut together a highlight reel from the raw footage we added to that little library. And there are the results. Now we could render this and clean it up a little, but I'm going to play it as is. We can change the look, by the way, by clicking the change the look button, and here we can add just by clicking change the look over and over, we can choose different looks for our video, but I'm going to just select an urban look and then uh, let's play it. Let's see how it looks. That's how simple it works. It's taken all the raw footage I've added to it and it's made a 59 second, very nice little highlight reel of the best moments from each of those video clips. A new feature here in version 2024 of Adobe Premiere Elements. Now, if you want to know more about this program and all the new features as well as all the old features in the program, check out the many tips and tutorials we have at moviepix.com. If you want to know everything about Premiere Elements, be sure to pick up the moviepix.com guide to Adobe Premiere Elements. That book is available at amazon.com. I'm Steve Grizzetti. I'm the guy who wrote the book, and I hope to see you again real soon. Take care.